Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolfie One Nolan, and welcome to Age of Magic. Just started out the game, and this is what I was welcome to. So yeah, we're gonna get into it, try it out. I never really grew up with it. Like, um, what the fuck was it? Age of Magic or something like that, or Magic or the Gathering stuff like that stuff. Never really grew up with it, so yeah. Thought I should at least try out the game now. See how it is. Alright, without further ado, let's get into it. I mean, the art style looks actually pretty interesting. I wish I could, you know, look at the skills. <laughs> okay, got yeah, shields. I'm guessing that's the basics. Yeah, those are basic attacks. Okay, so it's basically just like summer wars. You got two skills, you got one basic attack. Ah, kind of like her design. I'm interested to see the other characters' designs. Because, you know, some, some of them may be good by the splash art, but some of them are kind of like meh when it comes to like actual model. Oh, wait. I don't know. I really hope this is, isn't like a shark collecting game. I hope not, at least. Alright, so I'm still just running solo. Oh, they got Wukong. I don't really know if I'm interested in the story, to be honest. I think I might skip just to get more gameplay in. Okay, now I can see the skills. Trigger's boss class mark. I have no idea what that means. Okay, so his max HP generates. How much does he get? Yeah, him with all those buffs, I don't like. So let's get rid of him. Dude, the music is so gentle. Like, what the fuck, man? Trying to put me to sleep instead? <laughs> How long does the shield last? Oh, it doesn't say. I guess it lasts for until it runs out. Normally they would have like, hey, it lasts like two rounds or something. But nope, not, not this one. Oh yeah, it is a shark collecting. <sighs> shark collector games. Oh, this guy looks pretty sick. Love his design. That's probably gonna be the thumbnail, <laughs> to be honest. He looks too badass to pass up. Alright, heroes. Oh, it's also one of those um, equipment upgraders. Or at least I think it is. Oh, yeah, it is. It's basically how you would change their uh, ranking. Mm. 
Ooh, we're now level two. Oh, I'm now level three. Seems like they still give you some freedom of not, like, just carrying through the story. Or carrying through the tutorial is what I should say. Dude, you can't stop me. I'm already OP. I powered up and everything. Nice try, dude. Alright, yeah. Not really interested in the story. Yeah, I thought there would be like some badass like fighting music or something. I'll <laughs> be honest with you. Oh, you taunted. Okay, so I could look at the effects that are on me. Okay, that's what I was trying to say. <laughs> you were doing a lot of damage, dude. You were. Then I had to take you out. Not gonna lie, I always like badass music when I'm like fighting, not just soothing music through the whole thing. But I guess that's just me personally, huh? Alright, so now we have another friend to help us through our ways. Oh, he's even with us in the story? Does he actually have dialogue? Seems like it. Anyway. Okay. Pretty sure he's weak since we don't have anything on him. I guess does he taunt? Nope. No, he does not taunt. I figured he would. Does he taunt off his basics? Oh no. The lizard waifu. <laughs> Too bad she's not thick enough. Wait a minute. Oh, I could change targets at first. Ow. I knew you were going to target him. Let's kill the allies with the little minions. Okay, so yeah, now he taught. Okay, so it goes to everybody as a shield. It's not that bad. Usually, shielding type characters are like really good. Especially if you build off their HP. So that's like an extremely good starting unit. We gotta get him out. He just extra damage. Too much extra damage if you ask me. Get out of here. There we go, we played it well. <laughs> oh damn, he looks pretty badass too. Weird choice of axe though. Guess he's more of a Hawaiian character. <laughs> Oh, so they have the um, sweeping, basically sweep tickets. 
Well, since they don't force me to like follow the tutorial. Oh, they did give me uh, new stuff though. Oh my god. What is all this stuff? Just a whole bunch of energy. Noted. Just making sure these don't give me like any rewards or anything. Damn. These, these events have been going on for a while. Do they even update the game anymore? Or have... Or is it me? Have I not created the game? Uh, let me go make sure the game is up to date right quick. Turns out the game is up to date apparently. <laughs> what the fuck? Damn. Been a long time since this game's seen, seen an update, apparently. Huh. Okay. Or at least gave us news about it, I guess. It probably has received updates, just haven't, like, you know, had any news about it, I'm guessing. I can't even... Scroll. There we go. Damn, they have skins too. Wonder how much those cost. You know. You have any cool skins, dude? Nope. Feels bad. One chapter nine. That's all you have right now? Damn. All we have is five potions, dude. There you go. At least we can upgrade you a little bit. Actually, you know what? Let's just look at a few of the characters. I don't think I want to look at the skins right now. That actually make this a lot longer. I'll leave that to you guys. Start with safe freedom work our way. Damn. Sigfried looks like a badass. Wukong looks alright. Meh. Just gonna take glances. I got a sub samurai? Elf samurai, actually. <laughs> Dude, bring your rocks into battle? What the hell is wrong with you? Like I said, this guy looks completely badass. But he's probably like one. Oh, I thought he was gonna be a high rank character, but damn, I he's one star apparently. Groot. Seems like they have the whole cast here. <laughs> uh. Definitely say this. The designs are pretty unique. I like them. Oh my. Design wise, pretty nice.
You remind me of a dude from um, Hero of the Storm. The guy that liked to hook people. When I used to play Hero of the Storm, that is. <laughs> Damn, they have a lot of characters. For sure. And I give them props for having a lot of characters. The more characters, dude, the more variety. I fucks with it. I love a game with like a crap ton of characters. But like I said, I'm not sure if this game is still ongoing or if they've just let it sit here to die. If anybody could let me know that if you guys have been playing. I'm just curious. dare you. Yeah, I try to get through my defense now. Haha. <laughs> my defense is 100%. Wow, that, that attack sucks ass. <laughs> I'm just going to be honest with you, dude. But then again, you're a tank. You, you can't do much. To... You can't control what you get. You just gotta work with it. Oh, they put him to sleep? That's so rude. I'm trying to see if this carries on to the next stage. If there is a next stage. Doesn't look like it. Never mind. I'm like this is this is designed too. That's actually pretty cool. Really sick artwork you got there. All right, we'll go for a few more. that popping noise. I wasn't the only one who heard that, right? Really hope that's not in the video. Okay, so we do have another round after this. Sweet, so I can test my theory. Get out of here. We like the most dangerous one. Oh, there's even an auto if you want to. Hit him, and we're gonna put on a shield. See if it carries on the buffs. Well, not if he puts us to sleep, goddammit. Alright, the buffs do carry on. Sweet. Damn, dude, chill. Still think I'll save that. You're too OP, dude. Calm down. You have no skills in your pocket anymore. Now what? Use all two of your skills. <laughs> you noob. Should've took down our shields first. So now we have our DPS. That looks sick. <laughs> I'm complimenting a lot of the artwork at this point and not really much of the game itself. But then again, the artwork does make the game. It 
God, no. I'm good. Stop trying to throw prices at me. Alright. I am now level 4. So, is that literally all the quests I had? Okay, though. say the basic attacks do increase quite a bit we leveled them up but it seems like you can carry quite a few units but it seems like backup units compared to the three just in case one die and another one comes in and takes his place That one, I'm guessing. Oh, it only goes to one other person. What the fuck, man? Or maybe he has to be in the middle or something. Oh, I, I want to test that out now. These are like formations we have to actually be in. Could you not? Very rude of you. Now let's see what auto does. Oh, I was just proving that it's faster than me. Speaking of faster, there doesn't seem to be a time to speed. I guess they're thinking that, um, okay, I'm guessing they're thinking that the skip tickets are enough, basically. Which is definitely not. Because what happens if you run out of skip tickets? I'm guessing summonings are at level 10, but I don't think we can get to level 10 within the uh, minutes of playing. Doesn't seem you level too fast anyway. about the game so far uh kind of underwhelming so far like the art style is cool and everything the fighting i kind of like i think it's mostly the music and the impact of the sound that is throwing me off mostly at least how i feel so far It seems like you get quests daily to level up. So I would stop at level 4 today. Then tomorrow I can have a chance of leveling up the next day. So they're kind of limiting you to how fast you're leveling your account. That's a weird choice. I'm not sure if I like that. And from what I see, it doesn't seem like they're summoning, but I could be wrong. There's a shop that lets you buy stuff, I guess. Yeah, I feel like this game limits you a little bit too much. The things you can do. But it doesn't look like you can get shards. 
through summons and but they are like set summons from what I see for like different races huh alright I want to do one more and we're going to call it there okay so if I was to switch you two around he would be in the middle right Okay, so he's in the middle. So if my theory is correct, he should put it on all of them. If he's in the middle. Well, not if I get my turn skipped, you know. Totally won't be able to see that theory. Okay, now. I guess it just goes to the person with the lowest HP. Noted. Oh, there's a time suit speed. We finally got it. So the further you go in, the more mechanics you unlock without them basically telling you that you've unlocked it. I don't know, this game has a lot of potential. It really does. I just don't see them working too hard on it. This game has been out for like a while. I've had this game installed on my emulator for like day one of its like release. I just have not played it. I completely forgot about it. Well, I gotta say, it's just really underwhelming to be honest. Too bad, dude. It, it actually looked great art-wise. I guess you unlock all the characters as you uh, play. Like all of them are just straight up. Green. Nah, I don't think that's the case. Honestly, don't think that's the case. It's not like we're going down a roll unlocking everything, for sure. But I think I am pretty much done. Yeah. That's all I'm going to show. Well, guys, I pretty much gave you guys how I feel about the game. It, it's, like I said, underwhelming. But I can say this, art style, character models, 10 out of 10 are actually really good. Their attacks are kind of like pretty decent. The music, it doesn't change. It just stays the same, and that's pretty much it. I don't hear anything new. I don't... I don't know dude like you would figure like a game like this would have way way more music they do got some events over here I guess it would be more fun as I was to be like leveled up all the way up here but it seems like they majorly kind of <laughs> they kind of cut down your like farm which is weird. I mean, you can still level up by just doing the stages, but where is the level up by, you know, just doing missions? I guess that would be your fastest way to level then. Just keep going, going there and doing this. And look, we're level 10 now, guys. And now I can't level up anymore because I don't have any missions. I mean, we made it to level 10. That That's good, at least, I guess. And now we have a different campaign, I think. Yeah. Another different campaign. Just weird, overall. Oh uh, look, there's our summons. Hmm. 
Oh, they have time summons, if anything. And they're not even a guarantee of shards. They're more like items and shards mixed together. Standard, pretty much a standard shard collecting game. Shard collecting games always do that. They put shards and items together. But look at that. We got our quest back. Never mind. Alright, I'll take it back. At least they got some form of quest coming back, but... I guess we just had to play a little bit more. But then again... Are these daily? I'm guessing they're daily? I don't know. I, I think I'm done. But yeah, try the game yourself if you guys enjoyed. I think I'm gonna... Gonna have to skip this one. Even if it does, like, you know, kind of counter things I was saying, you know, like... It does give you a little bit of um, leveling and quest back, but I think that's as you level, though. Overall, pretty decent. And so then, I will see you guys next time. Peace out. Swear it's gonna get better real soon. Don't let anyone tell you what you should do. I got a clear view. We're gonna make it soon. Just keep pushing through. Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Just keep pushing through. Cause what you got to lose?